and welcome to Business Daily. In our lead story today, we look at how medical facilities in the country are now further strained under the weight of limited human resources as more skilled health professionals continue to emigrate to developed countries where improved working conditions and workers' welfare are guaranteed. Meanwhile, according to a statement from the group of oil-producing countries, OPEC Plus has handed Nigeria a 2024 oil output target lower than it has hoped for while lowering Angola's target. The move follows a meeting in June where OPEC Plus agreed a complex deal that revised production targets for several members. Finally, FMDQ Exchange has released its market monthly report for October, which shows secondary market turnover of 21.70 trillion naira. This level of turnover in October represents a month-on-month -month decrease of 6.75% and year-on-year -year increase of 60.27% from the turnover recorded in September 2023 and October 2022, respectively. These are some of our top stories today on Business Daily. For more stories, you can read up on our website at www.businessday.ng. Thanks for watching.